Hi my friends, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to react to basically the wrap up of the Justice League filming in the UK and you know I was really near when I went to the Harry Potter experience uh, there in London and I mean it's in the Lipsden studios and I remember you know trying to find something about the Justice League or DC and yes I found something I remember seeing a lot of DC posters of Suicide Squad over there it, it, it's, it was really cool I mean the Lipsden studios are really really far well at least for me it was really far I was so sleepy when I went to the Harry Potter experience that I literally fell asleep um, and I don't remember how long it was but I do remember it was really long because I you know I just fell asleep and I just woke up and we were there so I mean it's maybe a one hour and a half or two hours to go there um, uh, I mean it's so cool it's really cool but uh, to what I was going to is that it, it's so big that you can't actually see anything I mean we, I saw you know many studios there but I, I mean you they can't tell you where this you, that just is like it's you know doing their stuff and, and stuff but I do believe they were there when I went uh, I don't know I felt it I, I I don't know I think they they were there and I mean it was really really early in the morning maybe you know the director was there um, Zack Snyder was there uh, maybe Gal Gadot or something um, but I mean I really wanted to meet them but either way it was a really cool cool experience to be there and you know to see where they were recording and you know shooting all these amazing you know effects and amazing action but I mean I didn't know that they were gonna release this kind of you know wrap up uh, video and I'm really excited to watch it so let's just jump right into it and watch this awesome video there is a stranger who comes to this village from the sea he comes in the winter when people are hungry brings fish he comes on the king tide that was last night I just want to say a quick thanks to my cast and crew. It's been a great shoot, and thank you, UK. It's been amazing. Awesome! Oh my god, that's so cool. I mean, you guys, I don't know what to say, really. I'm really excited for this. It looks like DC is really, you know, pulling things up. I mean, I can judge, I haven't seen the movie, but it looks pretty incredible and I don't know, it's so weird because I, like, for me, if I, if I was an actress and I was dealing with a lot of green screen and stuff, I mean, you had to have a lot of imagination, a lot of great direction from the director, I mean, it's, it's really, really intense and, uh, I mean, I, I'm actually gonna do a short film, uh, really soon, uh, it's for a, uh, one of my classes and um, if I have the chance I will share it with you guys because I really want to be the actress there we're gonna use this type of uh, incredible you know cameras that we we saw here I mean I don't think I'm gonna be we are gonna be able to actually have the actual cameras of this Justice League movie because you know they are so expensive but uh, I mean in my university they have like really really cool um, uh, really really incredible uh, cameras uh, professional cameras that you can use so I'm really excited for that 
Um, so what I was going to about this is that, you know, it looks like they're, you know, they deal with a lot of, you know, uh, uh, maybe, I, I don't know how to say, maybe, you know, a lot of machines and a lot of, you know, special effects and a lot of, uh, you know, really, really intense tr training for them to be the way they were. And I mean, Aquaman, The Flash, uh, I mean, Ben Affleck is great. I mean, Cyborg looks awesome. I mean, I can't ask for better. I mean, I would love to have that training uh, with that, you know, with that, that, with that trainers that they are, that they had, because like seriously, like Gal Gadot is like role model for my body. Like I really wanna have that body. Like she, she, it's like an idol for me. And you know, we saw like Ben Affleck he completely transform himself. I mean, seriously, that like they look really, really, really good. And and I love that. Costumes, they really actually look really cool uh, without the special effects. I mean, I could like point out like a kid from like, I don't know, maybe from one to maybe 10 will be like so, am so amazed by the, uh, you know, the costumes uh, as well as, you know, a girl or a boy uh, from, I don't know, like, uh, from 18 to 50 years old. I mean, we all love these comic book, comic book characters, and I do really, really love this this kind of you know uh, turnout. And it's it's really like it's gonna take them a long time to edit these things. But I mean, I'm really excited for the Justice League, and I can't wait to see if Jared Leto is gonna make an appearance. I don't know about you guys, but do you think he's gonna make an appearance? If he's gonna make an appearance, will it be like the animated, you know, a series that we have from the Justice League? Because I would love to have that. I would love it. I would love to have Harley as well. You know, uh, there's particularly a scene where, where like, it's called the episode is called Wild Card, and you should go and watch it. It's really, really, really cool. I mean, that would be an awesome Justice League movie for me. Uh, will be awesome but either way i don't want to make this video so long but uh what do you guys think about the justice league do, do you think it's gonna be a success do you think it's not gonna be a success what could dc do to make it better what could dc do to make their movies better because we all know that dc has been struggling about that it like it doesn't matter if they have the numbers uh, of suicide squad and stuff they really need to uh, you know talk to the fans and know what they want and you know what do you guys think about it so either way uh, don't forget to subscribe like and share and to please 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 follow me on my Twitter and Instagram and well I'll see you next time guys have an awesome day see you guys